Okay, so today for camp, we're going to do a craft since it's Tuesday, the 7th, and we're going to do macaroni necklaces. So all you need is some sort of pasta, doesn't matter the kind, as long as you can put some string, string through, through them. Yeah. So we're going to use macaroni, me and Carson are. Um, and then you need some sort of string. So I looked around and I found floss, so that's what we're going to use. But you could use any sort of thread or if you have string. No. Needle thread, yeah, needle like that. Thread, yeah. Yep. So, um, the first step, what you're gonna want to do is take out some macaroni and uh, my needle. We'll color those. So we're gonna color a couple, and we want you guys to do the same, and then we'll be right back. So what we're doing is we're just doing a bunch of different colors for all of our macaroni so that we have a multicolored necklace. But you can do whatever designs you want. If you have bigger pieces of pasta, it might be easier to color those. Probably doesn't taste that good, Carson. Yeah, it does. Don't try that. It's hard on your teeth. Um, yeah. Ugh. Ugh. Right, it doesn't taste that good. And then we're just creating a little pile of our colored macaroni. Nope, not good one, a little bit. Hmm. all right. I have a lot of greens. We really have a lot of greens. Let's mm. do um, you two, and you, and then we'll that by you. I don't think yellow would look that good. No, I don't think it'll work either. Voice over over? Okay, so once you have, you keep coloring and I'll start stringing. So once you have some pieces, what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna pull out a fairly long, oh, this, I ran out of floss. Um, a fairly long piece. I'm gonna make it a bracelet. But you can make a necklace or a bracelet, any sort of jewelry. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to start putting these onto the piece of floss. And swipe oh, these it already. Just like this. So I just stringed it through the macaroni. And then we're just going to take all the different colors and Ooh. string these through. And if you don't get it the first time, don't struggle. You'll get it. It is kind of difficult. So for younger kids, this may be part where a parent can help out a little bit. A uh, brother or sister. Yeah, brother or sister. Just trying to get it all the way through. Another thing you could do instead of coloring them is either like painting them if you'd wanted. Ha ha! We got it! This did not take 15 tries. <laughs> so, as you can see, we're a little bit ahead of where you are now. We're trying to put the string on and we realized that um, it's a lot more difficult getting the string on when you're using floss than I thought it would be. So, although we used floss, it's definitely an option. You could use other strings that might be uh, not as bendable or even just stronger. The floss was a little bit weak and it started to fray a little bit Got it. as we were doing it. But as you can see, this is our macaroni bracelet. Let's see if we can put it on Carson's wrist. Probably not big enough. Huge. It's not quite complete, so we would maybe want to put a couple more pieces on, but we are struggling to get these couple pieces on, on, so this is going to be our craft for the day. I cannot wait to see all of your guys's. I hope that they turn out really awesome and are super pretty. Hopefully you'll sport them out for the day and maybe try them on. some of them. No, don't eat it. 
So as you can see, a little big. There's Carson's macaroni bracelet. I'll keep it. You can put it on. So, too. so, um, that was the craft for today. I hope you guys enjoy it and you have some fun with it. Um, be a little bit artsy. Let's see what you guys can get done. I'm excited to see all the results on Facebook. Uh, later today or this week. Um, tomorrow we'll be doing Workout Wednesday, so hope you tune in and get active with us. Uh, have a great Tuesday.